Anyways, uh, enough about Pokemon. Uh, let's talk about Kirby and Falcon. Duffman and NACL appearing on the stage. Duffman uh, beating me to a pulp on Saffron. Uh, yep, yep. And but uh, Duffman struggling with the Kirby matchup. It is a hard matchup for uh, Captain Falcon. Oh, really tough. This is a no fun zone for Falcon more often than not. He just needs to find a way around those up tilts and get a good grab. And then he needs to, like, oh, he could have gone in right there. <laughs> that random uh, up smash by Matt or NACL. And now the down tilt comes out. That's it without even taking a percent of damage. That's NACL. Zero to death. Taking the first stock. Not waiting at the ledge. And here's the thing, Duffman more often than not uh, will approach with uh, forward airs and approach with grabs. And as a Kirby, you have plenty of options to deal with both of those particular approaches. Right. Um, uh, the, the secret that I think that you said was it's all about trying to get around the up tilt initially, right? Trying to figure out a way where you can deal and space around the up tilt because that's when Kirby start getting a little bit more antsy. Uh, and they start maybe doing a, some of those more unsafe approaches, but so far it's been clean from NACL. Three stocks taking 33%. This is looking like it could be a wrap in any minute. And NACL gets the shield break. Oh, we're going <laughs> to see some shenanigans. Just oh, kidding. Loses it. The no fun zone. Yeah, another thing you can do is like just bait Kirby into doing an, like an unsafe option and you just punish it. <gasps> but your reaction has to be really quick. Well, he reacted pretty well to the Falcon punch. Yeah. <laughs> that was good. That was good. Love to see some more from Duffman. I see he'll having a little bit of fun, but has to be cautious. Even though this is one of Falcon's uh, worst matchups, it's still Falcon. Yeah. It's still Falcon at the end of the day. He can still get a zero to death on a Kirby. And another shield break. Is he going to take the Falcon punch? Uh, he wants it. You know, he does, He has been playing a little bit of that Falcon. Uh, he knows. He knows some of the shenanigans. I think uh, up tilt to Falcon Punch is a true combo. <laughs> what? I think so. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> I'm not too sure, but I think that's what Matt told me. Before. Oh, my God. Yeah, see, it was really close. Oh, my God. Please, Lord. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> yeah, Ed ACL gets the Falcon Punch in the first game of the set. <laughs> It's not every day you hear that. Uh, and it's, uh, <laughs> it's the Falcon. Yeah. With Kirby. It's one thing to end a game with a Falcon punch as, as Falcon. It's completely different to do it as as Kirby. <laughs> but uh, uh, NACL going to his secondary Ness. And now this Ness, uh, maybe a secondary for NACL, but it ain't no joke. I'll be honest. Way better Ness than mine. 10,000% uh, yeah. sure on that one. My Ness was garbage tier. I'm pretty sure when he was living in Austin, he played a lot with Z Rex. Yeah. And Z Rex has like a. Really good mess. Oh, yes. Maybe even donning the colors in honor of him. That black and yellow, the Wiz Khalifa Ness making a reappearance here. <laughs> <laughs> the one thing Ness like, struggles in is his recovery. Oh, yeah. Because he has to hit himself. And he has to aim that right. And as a Falcon, you have all the time in the world really to go and just, yeah, just stuff that out. Just jump out there, hit him with anything, a fair bear, or set bear. Oh. That's another big mistake here for Duffman. And that's going to be another stop. He had a good string going, but mm -hmm. couldn't finish it. Yeah, uh, I think he burned his jump uh, when he wasn't trying to. And that definitely cost him. <laughs> Dash attack coming out from it. From uh, Oh, I almost got confused for a second. I almost had an ACL, but it said it was Duffman. Well, and he misspaces that forward smash. That could have been the stock. Yeah. So now he's gonna, the bear finishes it. So Duffman up one stock. He's beaten one nest today, so he knows what to do here. He has that experience from you. Yeah. He, kn he knows not to get, uh, I guess, too antsy. Ness can come out so fast with the dare, and the dare just puts you at such an unfavorable position off stage, uh, right. even at, at very low percents. So so much fun. Right? But the forward grab takes a stock. It's now even two stocks for both players. Back throw, giving Duffman a bit of positioning, and that's exactly what Falcon wants. He just wants to keep forcing Ness off stage. Nice. 
nice. He gets it. And I think this could be the stock. Yeah, Ness is too far. Away. So NSL now down a stock and a game away. Sorry, a stock away really from this going to game three. Do you think he's going to stay Ness if he, if he loses? No. Do you think he believes in his Ness? Nah, nah, <laughs> nah. Yeah, but he's on. Is that 101%? Yeah, you're right. No, but that's it. I think he might go even do the Falcon Ditto. But knowing him, he's probably just going to do I'd like to see that. An ACL's Falcon. A wild zero appears. We definitely need to get him on commentary. Uh, yeah, we should. Get a second. That'll be fun. That'll be really fun. <laughs> oh, and he goes back to Kirby. Oh, but Def might going Pikachu. Whoa, really? I've never seen his Pikachu. I, I, yeah, definitely a surprise for us here. But uh, NACL, he really knows this Pikachu matchup. He's played a lot of Pikachu at uh, Genesis 3. He beat uh, Soto and Wookie. Yeah, he knows, he knows what to do. He, he, he beats Renegade like, consistently. But their games have been getting pretty close. But Duffman's Pikachu, uh, I'm not sure. I haven't seen it. I've, I've never seen it. I've just seen the Falcon. But it's good to see other characters coming out from uh, Duffman's pockets. That's one thing I notice a lot about 64 players is that they they have more than just one primary character more often than not, right? right. They can play like a lot of the cast at a, at a pretty good level. So good for NACL, spacing that uh, bear by Pikachu and punishing with the forward smash. This could be another big punish here. That's a dare, but sending Duffman on stage instead. <laughs> that was roll. great. Yep. Yeah, he almost like forced that out of Duffman because Duffman was just trying to think of some sort of defensive option. I would have uh, liked it better, I think, if he jumped out instead. Right. Right. Jumping out of your shield uh, is a really, really good tactic. Uh, more often than not, uh, especially compared to some of the abysmal rolls that this game provides you with. Whoa, and gets but enough to make it back on stage. <laughs> These tech chases from an ACL. Good lord. Good wow. lord. And the four stock. Did you notice how, how uh, he hadn't even gone to the blast zone and ACL already had the fist up? He oh, knew. Really? He knew that that was going to KO. He knows his percents. He knows his percents. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, am I playing?